Twitter was very nasty to me um, because I think a lot of angry people are on Twitter. I don't know if they are still on Twitter because I'm not very regular on Twitter anymore. But when I was very, very frequent on Twitter, there were a lot of angry people and they were faceless. On Instagram, they, they have faces, they have, you know, pictures that you can actually see. I can't teach you how to make money on a platform that I'm not very familiar with or a platform that didn't work for me. My book is about how you know this particular platform worked for me. So it's very personal, a lot of people don't know. Um, I'm teaching you how to make money on Instagram, does not mean that I, I'm teaching you, you know, the regular thing you know about Instagram. I'm teaching you how it worked for me, how I was able to break from the norm, how I was able, able to um, do you know something different i was uh, I, I personally was able to you know start and then start making money on instagram twitter didn't work twitter was very nasty to me it's in my book you should read it twitter was very nasty to me um because i think a lot of angry people are on twitter i don't know if they are still on twitter because i'm not very regular on twitter anymore but when i was very very frequent on twitter there were a lot of angry people and they were faceless on instagram they, they have faces they have you know pictures that you can actually see you know so and facebook i'm not an expert on facebook i go to facebook once in a while but i sleep eat drink dream on instagram and the platform has helped me helped me grow helped me become who i am today and yeah so my book is about teaching you how i was able to make it on this particular platform i can't say social media because i mean yeah that's a platform that didn't work for me This question is a question I haven't been asked before. And um, why why me? I have actually have 4,000 to 700,000. So if I have 4,000 followers tomorrow, I'll probably be 700,000. That's huge for a girl who was relatively unknown before, the, the plat before she joined the platform. Now listen, the thing is, I, there are a lot of celebrities with over 2 million followers, but their pages might not be or i don't think they are as engaging as mine yeah and their pages are not as commercial as mine i charge per post i advertise for people i i influence for people for example a you give me you give me your shirt and say please can you help me sell this shirt to your followers and you probably pay me hundred thousand naira hundred thousand naira to genevieve is a is chicken change right she wouldn't do it she will she probably feel like it's an insult to collect hundred thousand naira, but Elora, Elora will collect it. Elora will collect hundred thousand naira from say ten people a day. That's a lot of money for me. And no matter how cheap my page looks, it's money for me. It's something I do not mind. Um, a lot of these celebrities are they are big already. They don't they don't need they don't need any brand or any crowd to make them bigger than what they are. Um, my page has been able to engage a lot of young people. I post pictures and videos and talk to my followers. I post pictures and videos and make them know that I know them, I feel like I know them personally. A lot of, a lot of our celebrities do not do that because they are big already. So they don't need to impress you. I try as much as possible to impress every single follower that I have. Sure, for sure. Like, when I started Instagram, a lot of people wouldn't have followed me if I wasn't Linda Cage's sister in the beginning. So I wrote that in my book. In the beginning, a lot of people followed me because I was Linda Cage's sister. They would, they would put me on their page. They would put me, she, cause she, she always posted my pictures on her, her blog, you know, and her blog had a lot of youth, um, a lot of young people then, um, still does. Um, so yeah i think the first few thousands that i had on instagram were because of i was in the like, register nothing no content nothing so even if i had no content i'll probably still have like twenty thousand followers for sure for just being in the like, register so I, I would not take that for granted at all i have leveraged you know but i would i would say the only reason i am this relevant the only reason i am this um i don't want to use famous but the only reason i've been able to get to seven hundred thousand is because i've tried as much as possible to keep my followers um interested on my page 
I've tried as much as possible to engage them and then make the most out of being Linda KG sister. I think I think I've I think I've done well. I think I've done well. Like years back, they'll say Linda KG sister, Linda KG. But it feels good that when people call me Laura KG, I'm like, yeah, you know, feels really good. It's um, your private life is gone. No matter how how much you try to hide your family, your husband, your spouse, your 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 wife, your children, they would come after them. It's crazy. They will um, say bye bye if you if you want if you want this life. Say just say goodbye to 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 privacy um, because prior to me being um, married, my husband nobody knew his movements, knew where he was or where he lived or whatever. And since we got married, he, every, every move um, um, has been monitored online. You know, um, unfortunately for him, he joined Instagram too. <laughs> you know, everything hasn't been private since we got married. Um, people know people know my son. Um, um, even yeah, even before I posted the, the picture. Uh, your private life is over. It's over, and the thing is, it, it, at some point, it gets to affect your family, and your family members that do not like that kind of um, exposure. I don't mind. Like, <laughs> I don't. I don't want any privacy. I, I, my private life can be all over the world. I don't care. You know that because that's the life I chose. Um, I am very satisfied with that life, but um, I feel I feel bad for family members who do not like you know the exposure but yeah I don't think I have anything at all I don't think I have anything at all to say mother would change me a lot um uh, in terms of, uh, it, it's something you cannot explain when you have a baby. And this is your flesh and blood. This is somebody you brought to life. It's amazing. It's a feeling you cannot um, uh, explain to anybody. I can't explain it to you guys except you experience it yourself. Um, fortunately for me, I have a very supportive husband. Extremely supportive. And um, that's why I could do all this, do press, do... Uh, you know meet and greets and the rest of them because i have a very supportive husband but it's hard because um i i the only reason i go out these days are when i go i'm going for press you know interviews or i'm going to um things that are necessary i would not take my bag and say i'm going out to a club or to hang out with friends i i, I can't do that anymore you know because my son is priority um I think so, but Linda would never do it. I'm up for it. Hey. But Linda, Linda, Linda doesn't like TV at all. <laughs> She's very private. She will never do it. But I think my family is so interesting that it will work. My brother, my brother is everywhere. <laughs> um, there are some siblings in my family that wouldn't do it for a billion dollars because they are very, they are very private. But a few siblings in my family that would. That would do it, and um, it would be very interesting. But for Lin Linda, for sure, wouldn't do it. I think, I think the first thing the girl child should do is um, be yourself. Um, there are a lot of fakeness online. Trust me, there are a lot of fakeness online. Um, what you see is not what you get. Um, don't try as much. Don't don't try to be someone um, that you see online. <laughs> you can respect their hustle. You can res they can inspire you to be better, but do not try to be them. Um, I think the, your biggest inspiration should be your mom. Hey, girl, child, your biggest inspiration should be your mom.